Okay, so in this video, we'll be looking at the engine load analysis of the three cylinder Toyota Vits. Now, the condition is that we're going to turn on the AC going up a small hill, and we'll be looking using the blue driver scan tool to assess the operation of the vehicle going up this hill. Now, first of all, the information that we collected from the blue driver shows us that the vehicle is going five miles per hour going up this hill. And this is a bit slow when you press the gas pedal to the limit, getting just five miles per hour. Now looking at the engine load, it is basically 99.6%. And what this means is that the engine is basically maxed out. It, it, it has reached its full performance and cannot go any further at this moment. Now taking a look at the RPM, which is the engine rotation, it is 1944 rpm and when you look at the speed of the vehicle which is five miles per hour and compare the rpm which is 1444 rpm what it means is that the engine is rotating very fast in comparison to the speed that the vehicle is going now looking at the throttle position relative throttle position it is basically saying that it is 50% or a little notch above 50% open. So even going at a speed of 5 miles per hour and a rotation of 1944 rpm, the throttle position does not really need to open fully than the 50% because the vehicle is just going 5 miles per hour. And this is what helps to dictate the throttle position all right so based on this information that we have collected on the blue driver scan tool what is it saying about this vehicle now first of all you notice that the vehicle whenever it has load engine load it is not going to be able to go very fast from rest meaning that when the vehicle is just moving off you are not able to push the vehicle as fast as you would want it to go when it is starting from rest even if you flat the gas pedal and especially if you are going uphill it makes it even worse so what we are saying is that this vehicle is not really made to start very fast from rest and go off so if you are searching for a vehicle that can start very fast this is not the vehicle that you would want to purchase or if you are going uphill and you are starting from rest the vehicle will not go very fast at start so these are things that you have to take into consideration and especially if you're going to buy a vehicle and the vehicle you are considering to carry a certain amount of load probably two or three passengers on a regular basis maybe this is a vehicle that you may not want to consider because this vehicle does not perform very well carrying a lot of load all the time. If it is a situation where two persons or a person is going to drive this vehicle, well, this is a good situation for this vehicle. Now, for the type of driver that would want to have this vehicle, for example, female drivers, mainly they are the only ones driving and they do not pressure the vehicle much so probably they are a good fit for this type of vehicle and also for male drivers who are not really interested in carrying a lot of load and just casually driving from home to work and back home probably this is a fit for them but to carry load on a regular basis this is not the vehicle for it and especially if you want to drive very fast even starting at rest probably you need to consider buying a different type of vehicle in or a four-cylinder toyota vits if you prefer toyota vits vehicle type 